Hey guys, welcome back to Dual Rule 16. I am your host Javon, and today we're about for brand new benchmark. Today we're testing out Resident Evil Village for, well, the Gold Edition for the PC. Today I'm running this on my Intel Core i3-10105 with the AMD RX 570 4GB VRAM graphics card. I'm running with 16GB of DDR4 RAM in dual channel memory and boy oh boy, I forgot how optimized this game can be when you really want it to be. <laughs> so we're running at 1080p right now. I have a mixture of high and medium settings because we're gonna need it, trust me. <laughs> Uh, FXAA plus TA is on. We have to the quality up to 1 gigabyte on high, and that's only because, as you can see, my VRAM is maxed out. We have to fix the filter quality up to high as well. Mesh quality is high. And the occlusion, we have SSAO, screen reflections. I have this on because why not? Everything is on high here. We have shadow quality on mid. I think that's fine because I really wanted to reduce some of the. Uh, the round limitations here, but everything else is on. I, I just don't like that to feel. And what I realized is that I could do 1440p in this damn game. When I noticed that and realized I can do 1440p, like we're gonna, I might have to drop these settings down, but right now I have it locked to 60 FPS because why else? If I uncap it, it goes to like a hundred and something. Like it's ridiculous. <laughs> Because obviously there are only small rooms. I'm going to uncap it once we get outside. So don't worry. You're probably saying, hey, but we want to see the These frame rate. Things. Just give it a second, okay? When I get outside, I'll uncap it and see how that performs. Or at least this scene here. This scene I'll uncap it for just to see. How it maintains itself. But it is running quite well. And it looks quite good as well. This is a 1080p monitor I'm using with 75 hertz. It looks great. All things considered. Now, this is probably in a very intense area. It's so intense, the volume is absurd. And it's still doing over 90 FPS. I mean, come on. I've always said the game runs quite decently. This does not do it justice. This does not do that crap justice, dude. Like, I have to keep it calm if the terms of VRAM limitations, but... So, I can't even carry this to 1440p now that I think about it because... My... I'm, I'm out of VRAM. I've maxed up my VRAM, so anything else causes stutter, so... <laughs> So I gotta be careful on that one. What this? But yeah, this is a solid 60 FPS experience, a solid 75 FPS experience, a solid mainly everything experience in this game. It'll run basically on anything. Here, so like I said, there's not much else to change about this. We're, we're mostly inside, I imagine, for this game. We will go outside later, so we'll see if that has any more effect on it. But I think that these settings are pretty... These are pretty the best here for the RX 570 here. Like I said, 1440p isn't an option. We don't have the VRAM usage. We don't have the VRAM for it. I'm going to cap again until we get outside. There's no point. But yeah, this runs decently, man. But once again, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. You know me, showing you guys how games run on hardware like this, just so you know before you download it. And now you know, it runs surprisingly well. All things considered. Why is it when I want to sh- It's so weird, when I try to shoot for some reason she aims down, I don't- I don't understand. Interestingly weird. Another game that can do solid 60 though. 
And people said the RX 570 was done for. This is an old game, don't mind me. <laughs> but we're only using, we're using 7.5 gigabytes of normal RAM. I'd say that this is quite nice. Are you using even less than 8 gigs of RAM, dude? I mean, that's insane. And it's a smooth 1080p 60. If you really want to help, you can back me up against those things. The GPU's only using 100 watts, what? too. Like, that's nice. So, I'm on my own? But once again, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. I'm just going to mute myself. No, we're about to go outside, actually, so maybe I'll actually wait a minute. Because we are about to go outside. Yeah, here we go. So we're outside now, and the GPU has gone up to 68%. But that's about it. Maybe 70 a little hit, but it's still, even outside, it's still... Or in a cutscene, we're go in the cutscene, the cutscene goes higher. The cutscene definitely goes higher, but other than that, this is a smooth 60 FPS experience. I probably could have done 75 FPS to be, you know, just on the safe side, but just to push it a bit more. But other than that, this seems like this will be solid. Yeah, I'm just going to mute myself. Enjoy the rest of the gameplay, guys. I'm waiting for that. Maybe I can find a way across. <laughs> 